Oh, that's not good. My heart just started beating faster. What's up, Amazon survivors? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Green Hell. Just so you guys know, I recorded these episodes back to back, so if you give me any tips or anything, I have not seen your comments yet, but I really, really look forward to reading them. I think people are going to be really hyped for this series. Um, you know, I'm just sitting here thinking, well, you know, I kind of need some water, but this is taking forever. I don't see any coconuts, even though I probably passed 50 of them. What am I to do? What am I to do? I think what we're going to do is we're going to start a fire. Now, in order to have a fire, you have to have it underneath something. It's got to be protected from the rain, okay? It rains all the time. And no, you can't make a fire up here. Maybe you can. I've tried before, but I couldn't before. Well, let's, let's give it a shot. Let's give it a shot. Usually, you can't make a fire up on the area I'm standing on. Yeah, see, it goes underground, you know? So you can't make it up here. And by the way, if you make it underneath that wood... Right, right. You see where that fire is right there? If you make it underneath that wood, no, it does not block the rain. It will still go out. So uh, we need a place that will, uh, you know, protect the fire uh, from the from the rain. And I think, no, nah, you can't make it over here either. Hmm, can I break in here? You think I could break in there and put it over? That's a tarp. That's a tarp. This whole, this, this whole thing right here is brand new. So I don't know what you can do here and what you can't. So let's just try and break this. Why am I... Hmm. Seed a duck? Yeah, so I'm holding it down, but you, you can't duck and swing your axe, I guess? Oh, oh, I see. He's like, yeah, he's getting into it. That's what it is. So we're going to see if we could break this out. I should be able to break this out. It'd be kind of weird if you couldn't. Well, it looks like I can't. It should have broken by now. Hmm. No, that's odd. I should definitely be able to break that. Maybe maybe aiming down was the problem. Let's, let's try it like this. Shit. Seriously? Wait, did I drop it or did it break? <laughs> that's weird it just fell it fell out of my hands i've never seen that before all right no well, i guess we got to get some more stone i'm gonna assume you can't break that out so i'm gonna have to make my own i'm gonna have to make my own i don't know like uh, protection for the fire so i think what we're gonna do is oh right here oh, cage really really cage i'm so disappointed in you <laughs> actually this is to be expected <laughs> all right so let's just go make the fire here all right, so we're just going to make a regular fire. I'm not going to get too fancy with it. Uh, because what we could do is if we make the fire, then we can boil the water. Oh, look, water bottles. I can't take those, though. They do look pretty dingy, don't they? Uh, did I make the axe, or where is it? Ah, oh, it's there. Okay, there we go. I needed this number two, my man. Did I really seriously? Oh, <laughs> I thought I made the axe, and then I was like, did I make another pickaxe? No, you didn't make another pickaxe. You never made the axe, bro. You never made the axe. Okay, I, I, what I did was I took apart the stone. Okay, so let's go ahead and craft that. And then let's put some rope and a stick, and there we go. Now, we have an axe. There's some things in my bag I, I don't recognize. Uh, oh, small leaf piles, okay. Those will turn into... um. Uh, dried leaves, which you are going to need to to start the fire. So there's that. And let me see if we can find some uh, some coconuts over here. By the way, whenever I go to say coconuts, I always want to say cantaloupes. I don't know why. I really like cantaloupes, though. You hear that? Do I hear that? Okay. No. Looks like we're okay. I'm just kind of scouting out the area a little bit. Oh, that's a good good source of carbohydrates right there. I'm going to leave it alone for now, though. If we could find a banana tree, that would be best. Banana tree would be best. Okay. All right. Can we uh, do this fire yet? There we go. Now, should we light it now? I don't see any reason not to. Well, we're going to need a... We're going to need a fire starting thing. Um, I... Don't quite remember how to make that, uh, but oh look, we got some. We got a bird's nest there. That's for the uh, that's for the tinder. All right, so oh, I I know what we need for a fire starter. We need to break down one of these big logs. We need to break down one of these big trees and get a big old log, and then you break, and then you like harvest that log, and then you get like a board, and then you put a stick in it, and you could you know do a little drill thing into it. That's not something I can cut down, is it? Man, that's a that would be a big tree if I could cut that down, right? I figured if you couldn't cut it down, it wouldn't make the noise you were hitting it. But you want to you want to see the wood flying off, and you want to hear the thud, thud, thud. And these big logs here are fantastic, by the way. I love these things because they break. The, you get so many sticks out of them; they're they're just wonderful. They really are. So press Q to drop, in case you didn't know. Harvest. 
I'm gonna get a bunch of sticks and a board. And the board should be in there, and then you craft with the board and then a small stick. And you get a hand drill. And now, I believe I could start a fire. Nope. Gotta put that in there. Nope, that's not how you do it either. Oh boy, it's been a while. Use. There we go. And then we put that right there. Okay, yes! Yes! It's working! Okay, and there we go. Now we got a fire. All right, well, let's just go ahead and cook this meat. Stuff can burn, obviously. Keep an eye on it. We'll just go ahead and cook that up. We'll cook up the snail when we can. Um, you can put out the fire. And then we're going to... Oh, actually, that can burn. We should wait. No, that's going to take a little bit. Let's go grab the water. So what you do is you come over here. And you pick up the pot. Drink the water. Pick up the pot. Come to the edge of this water. Now, I don't... You, you couldn't boil this water here enough to make me drink it. But in this game, this is fine. So you're looking for a little marker. Is there a little marker? Should there be a little marker on there for me to dip this into the water? It's kind of weird. So I went ahead and grabbed the meat off of the uh, cooking, the you know, the fireplace so it wouldn't spoil. And um, there, we've got some meat, so that's awesome. And then I noticed, look at this. That, my friends, is a water catch. So what we're going to do is we're going to put this down here and we're going to catch some water. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go out and I'm going to look for some coconuts. Because I need coconuts. I can't just have one. Oh, here we go. Molinaria. Beautiful. Let's grab some Molinaria. Okay. There we go. And that should go right into your inventory. And then you right click and you go to craft. And there you go. Harvest will give you uh, leaves. For uh, dried leaves to start a fire. We want to keep that fire going. Well, I guess we really don't need to, but... Um, the thing is, you can keep the fire going, so you don't have to use more dried leaves, or you can just let it go out so you don't waste firewood. I can't do either. Um, there should be an ant... Oh, there we go, cantaloupe. And there should be an ant's nest over here, too. Yep, right there. Ant nest. There we go. Coconut, baby. Alright, now, now we're getting somewhere, people. Now we're getting somewhere. So we're going to do with this coconut. Oh, it's raining. Okay, good. Um, I'm going to bring this over here. And I forget how to break into this. Um, pick it up. No, you got to beat it while it's on the ground, right? Yeah. There we go. And now we take that. We should be able to drink that. Let's take a look. Yep, there we go. Drink. And then we uh, harvest. And then we eat. And we eat. And where'd the pieces go? Wait. Did they, oh, don't tell me I lose them. No, they go in my other bag. Okay. So now we got coconut bowls. And these things will gather water. So what I'm going to do with these... Now, this this is wasting firewood. So what I'm going to do with these... I'm going to wait for this to get some water. And I'm going to put this out. There you go. And then I'm going to leave these here to gather more water. I'm going to drop this just because it's in the way. Okay. I'm also going to drop these because I don't need them with me. There we go. And we do have some dry leaves. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a quick drink. And we're going to go look for a place. Look at that. 30 hydration. That's what I'm talking about. What do we need... Oh, God, we need... Well, we need the meat. So there we go. That meat will last a day, but we're going to eat it right now. And there we go. So what, how are we looking now? Okay, so we're going to need... We need more water. We need more protein. Um, so we're going to take one of these because if I find a water source, I'm going to want to know where I can get water from so I could boil water if needed. And then we're going to come on out here and we're going to check this trap because this trap might have gotten set off. And there might be... Nah, see... It got set off, but whatever whatever got trapped either went bad and disappeared, or it just got set off and didn't catch anything. All right, that's fair enough. I do want to find a water source though. I'm really, uh, can, oh, you know what? We need the meat. Let's get him. Let's get the snake. Where is he? I always have trouble spotting these pieces of crap. Oh, there he is. Look at this guy. Look at this freaking guy. All right, let's go ahead and get him. We'll cook him up. That'll help with some of the protein. And uh, you know what I do? I'm going to chop these bushes out so I don't get surprised again. Because it's, you know, it's just, I don't need this. I don't, I don't need these headaches in my life. You know what I mean? Let's get these things out of here. Get this one out of here. Get some stamina back. My guy's all, my guy's all tuckered out. There we go. All right. So I think what we're going to do now is I would like to find a water source so I can boil water um, whenever needed. 
that would be awesome. All right, guys, it's bright and early in the morning, and I need me some protein. Holy moly, do I need some protein. So what I did was I grabbed the cooking pot with the clean water, and I'm going to kind of put this on the on the um, fire. And then what we're going to do is, don't worry, we're going to go look for a water source at some point today. Hopefully I, hopefully I get the chance. Uh, we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to cook this on the fire. And I think if you are, if you don't, max out on your protein i think i can drink from this twice so that's meat soup right no nope, you can drink from it once i think the no it's it's the opposite it's not if you don't max out it's if you do max out or maybe they change it you only get one sip no matter what you do i don't know could be the case uh it didn't really seem to get me that many more so i'm gonna go ahead and cook that we're gonna go ahead and eat some of this i'm gonna go ahead and bring this out here and let that fill with more water actually you know what why don't we bring that over here? Because it does seem to fill with water quicker in this like water collector, which you know makes a hell of a lot of sense. So we're gonna go ahead and let that fill with water. Now what I did go out and about in between cuts and I grabbed this um, unknown bulb. I'll show you the tree I got this from uh, in a future video. Maybe, maybe today, next time I see this tree, I will show it to you. Cause this is gonna be your most important source of carbohydrates in the game, all right? It's like a tree with like red leaves, okay? Um, let me see what else I need while we're waiting for that water. Uh, mainly just protein, honestly. I mean, I guess I could have the banana. Might as well, right? And we'll have one of the unknown nuts. I also found these blue mushrooms on a tree. These things are what I like to call the monster energy mushrooms of the forest. Uh, they will give you ridiculous amounts of energy, which is just phenomenal. All right, so we do have some uh, leeches. Oh, boy, that's a lot of leeches. The, the collision detection on grabbing these leeches is kind of annoying, but we'll get there. We'll get there. All right. That's looking pretty good. All right, so how's that water coming? Did that fill up? It stopped raining. Uh, uh, only six. Okay, well, I guess that'll be good enough. Actually, I don't know how that will work with only six water um, in here. I think another thing we have to do is we have to make a Biden or a Badone. You know, um, different people say it different ways. Uh, then that'll give us a way to, uh, you know, carry water around a lot more effectively. So we're going to go ahead and dump that in there. And then we'll bring this out here. Is that clean? Yes. All right. So that's that's got to be almost full now. Yeah, 26. That's good. Bring this back out here. And then we're going to do is we're going to put the bulb in there and make some, some soup. It's going to be cassava soup, right? Cassava? I think I said that right. So we're going to go ahead and let that cook up. And then uh, I think we're going to go out and look for a water source. I think that's going to be our, our next move. Cassava. Okay. So there you go, guys. So you see what happened. Okay. I just wanted to confirm if what you're drinking out of the soup okay so when you drink out of a bowl these um these bowls right here only hold 10 liquid okay so the soup will only be 10. this thing right here holds 30. okay there's also turtles you can get we'll get into that later um but that only, that holds 30. so what you can do is if whatever you're looking for the cassava soup gives you carbohydrates my carbohydrates filled up while i was drinking the cassava soup so because of that I didn't finish the cassava soup. And I think if I drink that cassava soup again, it will give me the full, you know, um, damn the meat. Oh God, I thought I burned it. Um, if I eat from that again, it will give me the full effect of the cassava soup, which will just be phenomenal. Just be phenomenal. All right, we can't put the freaking thing out because I don't have any water, uh, which kind of blows. Uh, but what are you going to do? I think what we need is we need to find, uh, first thing we're going to do is save the game because we've done a lot. And then we're going to look for another coconut, and we're going to make a badone, and then we're going to look for a water source. I think that's going to be our, our you know, number one concern here. All right? This is not going to be the typical survival game that I normally play, where we get, like, everything done in, like, a few videos. It's going to be a slow burn um, with this game, but it's going to be a fun burn. It certainly is. Okay, so I think we're going to go this way. I think we're going to go this way. I was looking... What I was doing is in between cuts, when I was, like, wandering around the forest... Uh, when I found that bulb, I was looking for, um, I was looking for coconuts, but I couldn't freaking find any. This plant right here is really good for something. I don't remember what. Eh, let's, let's knock it out and see. Is this, um, tobacco or, yep, tobacco. Okay. So if you take tobacco and you put it with Molinaria, nothing happens. Oh, <laughs> you got to put it with the bandage cage. Dumbass. And it'll give you tobacco dressing. And correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, but I believe that tobacco dressing is for poison. Poison? Hmm? That's a question mark. 
So now we are kind of set if we get poisoned, at least, you know, for once. Also, poison, uh, being poisoned will give you a, um, a fever. And there's some uh, red plants around here that will help with fever as well. Okay. All right, let's find a coconut. Make a bedone. Biden. Not really sure. I kind of like the word bedone. It's such a core, cool, right? My bedone. I got to get my bedone to hold my water. All right. Probably shouldn't be host, uh, harvesting all these stones. You need these big stones to make the fire pit, like the circle fire pit. And I do want to make that at some point. But not right now. I think protein's going to be a problem too. Yeah, protein doesn't ain't looking too good. Um, we should probably check that kill trap. We could probably... The fudge. The fudge and fudge are you yelling at? Could probably nail one of these guys with the spear too. Okay, that's just thunder. Okay. Okay, let's be a little careful around here. Looking for coconuts, Cage. Try and stay focused, bud. And I get so distracted so easily. I'm like, I'm over here looking for coconuts. I'm like, ooh, I've got to get a coconut. We need it to get, you know, water. And then I'm like, oh, that, that dog has a puffy tail. Here, puff. Here, puff. If anyone can tell me what that's from, you are cool in my book. There's more tobacco leaves. That's good. Oh, no space in backpack. That's not good. No, it is good. It means we have a lot of uh, a lot of rope. All right, let's kind of see if we can find some coconuts here. I'm not, fi I'm not finding any. But uh, did they, did they make coconuts like a lot like rarer, or am I just missing them? Honestly, either neither would surprise me. They make them more rare, or I'm just walking over them continuously. Okay, what do we got over here? Nothing. Uh, we got some more mushrooms. Which I'm going to leave B. Mushrooms can help with parasites, by the way. There's another... Uh, what, is, what is this for? I don't remember what this is for. This isn't the tobacco, is it? Unknown herb. I forget what that's for. Hold on. Oh. No, I keep using the wrong thing. Lily dressing. I want to say that's... Uh, I don't know what that's for. I forget. Totally forget. Alright. It is what it is. Alright, you know what? I'm going to try and nail one of these guys. Damn it. Here goes my spear. Got to hit him in the head or something. Damn it. I should have another spear. <laughs> should have another spear waiting. And eh, it's a cheap spear. But still. It's more that the guy's getting away. All right. See, this is me getting unfocused. You're you're looking for you're looking for freaking coconuts, and you threw a spear at a guy. And now you don't have a spear. Okay. Should have two spears or a better spear. Okay. There's a dead bird over here. Again, anytime there's a dead bird, be careful. Listen for the spider. Okay. We could definitely uh, harvest him for feathers and food, for some protein. I do have two spears on me, by the way, but they're weak spears. Honestly, I don't even know if having two spears is going to help. Because as soon as I... I mean, I guess if I throw the one and he starts to run away, I could throw the other one quickly before he actually gets anywhere. But I'm not really good at throwing the spears. I don't like throwing the spears because you got to hold down the middle mouse button to throw them, and that's very awkward. By the way, this tree right here, that's the one you break up, and you can use the leaves that you get from it. Um, for uh, To help with fever, I think you cook it into a soup or something. I've never done it. I usually just deal with the fever. Like a man. I don't... I ignore it. <laughs> That's how men deal with problems. Although, probably not the best idea in a survival situation to ignore any problems. But... I gotta be me. Where is this stupid coconut tree? Man, seriously. I keep forgetting. That's what I'm thinking. I, I walk through here and I forget about I'm looking for coconuts. And I just know. I just know. I'm walking over tons of coconuts. But maybe not. Maybe they... I mean... I don't know, maybe not. Like, because I... They might have just made them a lot rarer. Well, here's the tree with the bulb on it. That's what the tree looks like. Let's go ahead and grab some more of that. For the cassava soup. Stuff is, um... You know, carbo... Stupid piece of shit. Uh, carbohydrates are really, really important uh, in this game. So, this tree is going to save your life. And it's going to save it repeatedly. 
So let's just go ahead and do that. As a matter of fact, I'm having a lot of problems with protein, man. I'm gonna have to get back to base and get some protein, but I really wanted to find the damn, damn coconuts, dude. I don't know where the hell they are. So what you do is you knock this thing down, you wait for those things, you wait for all the leaves to disappear, and then you grab the bulb that's underneath the leaves. Three, two, one, poof. There we go. Oh, crap. I got ants all over me. Not good. Not good. I'm not really sure how to handle this. Um, let me see if uh, I have any spots on my arms or legs. Well, they'd probably be on my legs. Oh, there we go. Okay, so maybe... Maybe that's what I'm, what I'm supposed to use that lily dressing for. Because I'm not really sure. I don't remember what lily dressing is for. Dude, I never noticed this. Look at this. It's almost like I have a solar panel on there. Um, lily dressing. So how do we do this? Bring up your arms. Okay, use the wheel limb. Okay. Um, rotate in order to find or heal wounds. Okay. So there we go. And the lily dressing. There we go. I think that's what the lily dressing is for. Because I, I knew it wasn't for anything I normally have a problem with. I don't normally walk through ants' nests like a dumbass. Um, you know. But I guess it's it's going to happen. It's bound to happen sometimes. Alright, so we have some problems with uh, sanity. I don't know if that's because of my wound or if I have leeches. Let's take a look for some leeches. Oh, crap. I got more. Damn it. That's not good. I don't have any more lily dressing. Oh! That was no, that was Lily. Yeah, I didn't I didn't grab any. I left the rest of it on the ground. Ah, eh, whatever. He'll just have to deal with it. Alright, well we're home. So what I'm gonna do is I think we're going to go ahead and check that trap and hopefully we have some um hopefully we have some protein in the trap. And uh like I said, I have not been finding any coconuts. I'm not really sure. Oh look at this thing's still going. We'll eat that because why not? That's still empty, so is that, so we can't put the fire out. That is fine. Let's check the trap. There might be a snake over here again. Let's be quiet for the snake. Nope. Trap is down, but whatever it caught is probably... Got, it probably caught something in it. Like, you know, it just... You got to check this trap often. That's the thing. Ooh, wait a minute. Hold on. I got a rash. Oh, is that Lily? I don't think that's a Lily. I think it's the back. Oh, wait. No, that's new. I don't recognize that. Unknown herb. Where is it? Is that this? No, that's tobacco leaf. Where's the unknown herb? Okay. Oh, okay. So maybe we'll save and then we'll eat that. <laughs> See what happens. Cause I'm kind of curious. Um, yeah, maybe. Eh, I don't. Th actually, I don't think I'm gonna. I don't think I'm gonna do that. I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna take take apart the bird. And hopefully the meat's not spoiled. If you wait too long, the meat can come out spoiled. Uh, nope, it's good. Yeah, let's go ahead and cook this up. Of course, that fire is going to be out now. Because why wouldn't it be? Nope, it's not out yet. Do we have enough to cook? Eh, probably. I could always put some wood on it. Yeah, let's put some wood on it. Why not? See, so just put it right there. And that gives you some more burn time. I'm also going to pick this up. And no, I'm not because I'm going to ruin my backpack. By the way, guys, um, if you look on the bottom left-hand side, my I'm almost ready to pass out. You don't want to pass out. Don't pass out. Oh, look at that. I got the FPS and stuff on the screen. I don't know how I did that. Oh, it's the tilde key. Oh, interesting. Look at that. You can see my FPS. You want to see my FPS for the rest of the video? You know you do. I probably shouldn't have slept that long, by the way. But um, our rash is now gone, so that's cool. How is that fire still going? I just slept for a long freaking time, and the meat's probably burned. Yep, all right, well, whatever. It's fine. It, you know, honestly, that meat wouldn't have given me an, a lot anyway. I'll destroy that stuff later. Let's go ahead and save the game. And then I'm going to eat. Ooh, do I still have a rash? Or is that leeches? No, it's leeches. There they are. Man, they're sneaky little buggers, aren't they? Look at them. All right, we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and sleep through the night. I'm gonna eat those uh, berries. Those berries are new, at least for me. Um, so you know, maybe you know what they do, but I don't. And we're gonna find out. If I puke up my guts, you know, I'll know. <laughs> then I'll know. All right, let's see what let's see what these things are. Yep, that's some nasty food poisoning right there. Holy crap! Now I don't think there's anything I have that can. I don't think charcoal gets rid of food poisoning. 
Oh, it does. But only one thing of food poisoning. So we still have food poisoning. Uh, food poisoning will kill you quick. So you gotta be very careful with that. You know, puking up your guts is not good for you. That's why I saved the game. Um, I don't have any more charcoal, unfortunately, but... Alright, well, whatevs. I guess we'll just have to wait and see if we die. Yeah, let's just go to sleep. You know, I, we're gonna go to sleep, and you don't want to be puking in your sleep, but I think we'll just lay on our side. We'll be alright. We'll be alright. Let's sleep in our shelter. Alright, guys, we survived through the night. Our health isn't looking too good because we puked up our guts. Probably thirst. Oh, yeah. Look at that. See, that's what it is. You puke up, and then you don't have anything left in your stomach. And that's where the problem is. It's not the puking that kills you. It's not having anything in your system. Um, let's go check the trap really quick. Um, we do have to call this one pretty soon, though. Uh, we're going to keep this thing going. It does take stamina, like strength, to start a fire. And if you're low on stamina, you, there could be times where you can't even start a fire. Uh, then you got to sleep. So let's come over here and check this trap. And... Nah. Damn it. Alright, we, we're going to have to hunt something. We got to eat, man. This is a problem. This is a serious, serious problem with that protein. Nice! That was the same one, wasn't it? Or maybe I just hit him in the head. Cool! We got a peccary. We're gonna live! Maybe. Let's get over there and get this meat on the fire. Oh my goodness. I know I have leeches. I don't care. This is not important right now. What's important is I get some protein in my system. Then we have to find some, some fats. Although I think this meat comes with fats as well. So that's gonna be freaking awesome. Alright, so we should have a lot of... Uh, three pieces. Okay. Put one there, one there. Let's add some uh, some of this to the fire. My timer already went off too, so we, we gotta call this one. But this is, you know, can't call it now, guys. We gotta find out if we're gonna live. You know, it's important. Is there any uh, water in there? No. Oh yeah, there is. Seven, that's not really a lot. Uh, well, with all of those, that's 27. Yeah, all right, so we're gonna grab this water. Grab this water. I'm probably going to find a coconut off camera, guys, because, like, like it's spending way too much time around in the woods looking for a damn coconut. It's kind of... It's not very good. Not very good. Got to dump that in there. Dump that in there. Drop that. Drop that. Wait for that to cook, and I will look for some unknown nuts while I wait for that to cook. Oh, that's not good. My heart just started beating faster. Um, it did start raining. I am I am filthy, but it started raining, so the filth is is, like, you know coming off me uh let's just go ahead and drink if you eat while filthy you can get uh food poisoning so i do want to get all this rain off you can see in the bottom left hand side of the of the of the screen that's like a mud thing um and i got dirty doing something you know who knows but uh so that's gonna go off now okay good now i can eat if i need to all right so we got some food there um, i gotta drink man honestly thirst is the major issue right now uh, well, protein. Oh, God. Oh, God. Come on. Cook, damn you. Cook! Cook faster! Should have 27 in there, right? 28, good. Drink and drink. And the food is just about cooked. Beautiful. Now, this should have fat in it, too. I think this is, like, the best, like, food in the game. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. That's what I'm talking about. Protein, fats, energy, sanity. Hells yeah. And we'll put that right there. And then what we'll do is we'll cook the unknown bulb. And we'll grab this. And we'll cook some more meat. Oh, God. Man. That was something. Oh, boy. Hell of an episode, people. Hell of an episode. All right, let's go ahead and eat some bananas, too. I did find some bananas while I was out looking for, uh, for all the other stuff. <laughs> for all the other stuff I was looking for, I found the bananas. Thank God. i got to find some turtles, man. Get some... Uh, if you get some uh, turtle, uh, what you could do is you could use their shell, and their shells will hold as much as the, you know, as the pot. Now I don't want to drink out of that pot. I don't want to. I don't want to eat the uh, carbohydrates out of that pot. Oh, I can now. Okay. There we go. Oh, it, it drink it all. That's interesting. I didn't think it would have because it filled up my carbs, but I don't know. Apparently that's not the way it works. Let's go ahead and eat that. Woo! Man, we really. Uh, uh, God, there we go. We really brought this one back from the brink, huh, people? Okay. 
that right there. I think when I end this episode, I'm going to go out and find a god darn freaking uh, coconut. Man, I really almost caught a cantaloupe like every time. I like cantaloupe, guys. Cantaloupe is a great low sugar fruit, man. It really is. Cantaloupe and strawberries are two things you can have while on a diet that actually is not like just too much sugar. I like bananas too, but you got to go easy with bananas. They do have a lot of sugar in them. And, and some people say it's good sugar, and it probably is. It's not like the same kind of sugar you get in like candy bars or anything, but still, it's still sugar. All right, I'm going to let that cook. And let's check the trap really quick. Oh, oh, look at this. Look at this. Yeah, boy. It's all coming up cage. All right, guys, I'm going to go look for a cantaloupe, also known as a coconut. <laughs> <laughs> off camera and i think we're just about done here uh you know guys if you want to see more of this series make sure you you know leave the comments and, and like the video tell your friends share it on twitter all that tell people in your discord all that good stuff thank you very much for watching guys i'll see you next time and until then take it easy